Wouldn't it be amazing for adoption if everyone could buy stuff on Amazon with Bitcoin? Well, we actually already can. Hi, I am Adrian from the Bitcoin for Beginners team. I have committed myself to my own Bitcoin adoption challenge where I buy a real world product or service each month with Bitcoin. The basic idea is that we can increase adoption, support the merchants and increase real economic trade if we all bought at least one product per month using Bitcoin as payment method. Check out the video link popping up in the corner for a short explainer with more details. I encourage all our viewers to join this adoption challenge and take on this commitment as a new habit for yourself. To know more about the instructions that I set for myself, check out the short list that comes after the demo. Today we are going to buy books on Amazon. Yes, on Amazon, even though they don't even accept Bitcoin as payment methods. In the overview of my personal instructions of my commitment that you see here, you see that the payment for my purchase should happen on the Bitcoin network itself, so that the network is actually involved in the purchase. However, sometimes in a particular month, it may prove hard to find a product you need with a merchant that accepts Bitcoin. As alternative, you could use a gift card website such as Bitrefill, because those will give you access to a tremendous variety of merchants and all of their products. At least you will be supporting the platform Bitrefill that serves as a vital bridge between Bitcoin and real world products. Plus, you can earn rewards by purchasing through them. And they even offer Amazon gift cards, which means you can buy virtually any product you want using Bitcoin, which I am going to show you in this demonstration. But I would also like to know what will you buy with Bitcoin? Let us know in the comment section. First, a short overview of the step-by-step -step process that we have to go through when we buy books on Amazon with Bitcoin. Discover the amount payable, including shipping, etc. by picking the products and view the checkout amount. Then go to Bitrefill, choose Amazon or another merchant for gift cards. Select the gift card amount, buy at least the checkout amount from the shopping cart, buy the gift card with Bitcoin and receive the gift card code. Then top up your gift card balance in your Amazon account, check out the shopping basket at Amazon and buy the products. And as always, the amount in Bitcoin that I spent for any product at any merchant, I will immediately buy the same amount back on the exchange, so I will not lose any of my satoshis from my hodl stash. Before we continue this episode, if you like our content, please give this video a like and additionally subscribe to our channel for more of our updates. Let's buy some books on Amazon and pay with Bitcoin. For my country, I have to use the German Amazon.de and I use my account there. First, I am going to see what I want to buy to know how much it costs so I know how much I should top up my Amazon gift card credit. This is my first book that I want to order and usually I prefer to buy used books to be less wasteful and preferably from independent merchants on Amazon instead of from Amazon itself. For the next book, I will use the search bar. Tools of Titans is the book by the author Tim Ferriss, who is most famous from his book that for our work week. Again, I select a used item and add to basket. When I'm done, just proceed to check out the shopping basket to find out the total cost including shipping. By the way, I am using example personal data only for this video, so the address etc are not real. Alright, at this point we can see the total order price is 21.52 euro and that's the amount we need to top up in our account. Now let's go to our account to see where we can top up. Select gift cards and top up here and redeem a gift card. This is where we eventually need to enter the gift card codes that we are going to purchase on Bitrefill. Let's go to the Bitrefill website on bitrefill.com. I used this website in a previous video as well to top up mobile phone balances. But on Bitrefill you can also top up all kinds of gift cards easily that you can spend in many online shops and most notably even Amazon. For my country I have to top up for the German Amazon. On this screen I can select or enter the amount that I want to purchase a gift card code for. I need a little over 2150 but I'm going to be on the safe side and top up 23 euro. And then click on add one to cart. Then proceed to check out. I am going to need to enter an email address here for order status updates and to receive my gift card. Of course, for this video, I am not using my own address, but a temporary one. Then continue. Choose Bitcoin BTC as payment method. And here is the payment screen with the QR code so I can pay the required amount of Bitcoin. After opening my mobile wallet, I can choose to activate the QR reader and scan the code from the computer screen. And my wallet will show the address and amount which I should verify with what the computer screen shows. Then review my transaction. The Bitrefill payment screen says I should use a fee of at least 6 satoshis per byte for processing without order confirmations. So I will set my network fee at about 10 satoshis per byte. Click to send and then yes to confirm. 
the transaction will be created and broadcasted. Within a few seconds, you can see on the computer screen that BitRefill has recognized my transaction and after that also my wallet will pick it up as pending. And indeed, almost immediately my gift card order is completed and it will show the Amazon codes that I need to use. And here I can copy it to my clipboard. By the way, it will also be sent to my email address and here you can see I also received the code by email. Now we can return to the Amazon site and choose to redeem a gift card in my account. Paste the code into the field and click apply to your balance. And you will see that 23 euro has been applied successfully to my account. At this point it is time to return to my shopping basket on Amazon where my books order is still parked. Again I proceed to check out, choose my delivery address, if available, delivery options and continue. Now you can see that my available gift card balance is already selected to be used, so we can just click continue. And in this screen it shows that the gift card is subtracted from the order amount, so the remaining payment amount is zero, and I can just click buy now to order. It will confirm that my order has been placed, just like that. Now I have to wait until my order arrives, but right after doing this purchase, I want to replenish my spent Bitcoin, so I will go to my exchange account. In this case, I will use market order and then enter the amount of Bitcoin that I spent, including fees. The fees that I spent in the transaction on BitRefill were in fact the equivalent of about 20 to 25 dollar cent. Click buy XPT with Euro and my order will instantly be filled, as you can see here in the order confirmation, which means I successfully replenished the Satoshis that I spent. The first book arrived already within a few days and the second a while after, but here I have both my books from Amazon together. And I can start unpacking them so you can see that the order I purchased on Amazon and effectively paid for with Bitcoin has indeed materially and physically arrived at my home. BitRefill offers a tremendous service by converting your Bitcoin into gift cards so you can buy virtually anything you want independent of whether a merchant accepts Bitcoin or not. Please use them anytime that you can't use Bitcoin directly to pay for something you want to buy. Before we move to the final part of the video, please check out the pinned comment below for our special offer. If you would like to start with this Bitcoin adoption challenge yourself as well, which I strongly encourage you to do, then I advise you to follow my instructions and recommendations, and once again for a more in-depth explainer, find the link in the description. My first rule is that I commit myself to make at least one payment with Bitcoin each month to buy a real-world non-crypto related product or service, and a transaction needs to be done on the Bitcoin or Lightning network. If it's not possible to find anything to buy with Bitcoin, then by exception use a gift card site like BitRefill like we did in this video. Restore your HODL balance in Satoshis because most merchants immediately sell the Bitcoin they receive, which causes sell pressure in the market, even how tiny it is by your personal purchase. Offset this sell pressure by replenishing the spent Satoshis with a buy order for the same amount on your exchange. As preparation for a smooth and hassle-free execution of your commitment, make sure your mobile wallet always has a spendable Bitcoin amount and make sure you always keep your exchange account funded with a similar amount in USD so you can always execute immediately when a purchase opportunity presents itself. That's about all, don't forget to smash the like button to show your appreciation. And also, if you like our content and want to see more episodes like this one, then follow us by subscribing to our channel. If you already have done all that, check out one of the videos that are featured here. Looking forward to see you all next time. Take care.